when photography came to India. It's so easy to click a photograph, right? You press a button and an image is automatically saved by the camera onto our phones. But it wasn't always so easy. Things were quite different more than 180 years ago when the first camera came to India. It took one or two whole minutes to click a single photo. So while posing for a photograph, people had to stay still for 60 seconds. This is why if you look at really old photographs, you'll find that most people aren't smiling in them. It was difficult to hold a smile for more than a few seconds. Would you like to try? If they moved, the photograph could end up looking something like this. Photography came to India in 1840. At that time, the camera was so big that it had to be placed on a stand. And the entire camera equipment weighed around 50 kilos. The camera then was designed like a large wooden sliding box and needed to be handled carefully. To take a photograph was like conducting a science experiment. Photographers used chemicals like mercury and sodium salts to transfer the images that were taken onto light sensitive surfaces like copper and glass plates coated with silver. They also required a separate dark room set up on location to develop the photographs. So photographers needed large teams of people and many bullock carts to carry all the photographic equipment. In the late 1850s, Samuel Bourne, a British photographer, travelled with a team of 80 Indian workers camping across the freezing Himalayan mountains for six months to photograph the landscape. This is one of the landscape images he took of where the river Ganga originates. Bond took this image to share it with people in his own country, England, who had never seen a scene like this before. This is probably one of the earliest images of the Himalayas and so the photograph is a valuable historical record. These images are clicked by one of the earliest known Indian photographers, Lala Deen Dayal, almost 130 years ago. Gradually, over time, the camera became affordable and smaller and smaller in size, like the one that most of us use today on our mobile phones. Since the time photography first came to India, it has changed the way we view the world. We do not just capture buildings and landscapes, we tell stories through images and photographs of ourselves, our loved ones and our experiences. If you could click only one image, what would you capture? Share your answers with us.